All right, guys. I'll show you a little bit of can of cooking here. We're gonna pour our uh, butter mixture into the colander. Here we go. Oh, that's hot. That is so hot. You want to be really careful when you're doing this, guys, because it's really freaking hot. You do not want to burn yourself. It'd be pretty easy to mess up and burn yourself. So, you want to be extra careful. As you can see, I already clumped all out. Not the end of the world. Well, at least it's not the butter mixture. So, luckily, we've got a nice clean sink here. Sanitized and all that. So, no need to worry. We've got everything in place to be as clean and best quality we can get. So, almost done. We just got a wooden spoon here and get the rest of the stuff. See that there's still some chunky buttery stuff in there. We want to get that out. So, mix it up. Really trying to smash it in there. Is the sides of the colander. Squeeze the sleeves and the trim. Squeeze that. Squeeze it. As best as you can, guys. Just want to get as much as we can out. That's butter. That will solidify. That will solidify. I'm getting a lot here. A lot. I even, I'm tempted to use my hands, but it's really hot. It's really, really hot. So we're just going to use the squeezing of it. Pretty tedious, sort of. Much of that out as you can. Because that's where the oil is absorbing. You want to get that out. And into the mixture. Because the water and the oil are going to separate once you put it in the fridge. Oh yeah. See, that's about as best as I can get it. So, there you go. Now all we have to do is put her inside the fridge. I'll be all set. See you next time guys.